Welcome to the OC Varsity Top 10. I'm Jonathan Gamis, and how about we get this show started off with the first long ball of the season. El Toro's Chris Manning connects off San Clemente's Zach Mason. Manning went 4 for 5 with 5 RBIs in a 13-7 Chargers victory. Getting it done, son! At number 9, it's Brea Olinda's Jinier Olukemi finishing off the fast break and one. She finished with 12 points and 12 rebounds against Modern Day. All right, everybody real quiet for this golf highlight. Tesoro's Dan Martin is looking to put the ball in the hole, and it's rolling, rolling, rolling. Wow, we almost made it. Great shot. Shh. Sorry. Girls lacrosse and Morgan Chaney picks up the assist from behind the net. So he keep there on the goal. At number six, it's DeSoro's first baseman, Connor Spencer, diving and making a nice catch. Breaking into the top five is boys lacrosse. And check out this play from Griffin Foster as he delivers a sweet lead pass to Riley Higgins for a score. Volleyball debuts in the top ten and we're rallying and rallying and rallying until Mission Viejo's Joey Eggers spikes modern day. At number three, looks like a single coming off the bat, but Cassandra Ruland is there to make an outstanding catch. Does Tyler Lamb work magic shows in his spare time? Because he was downright tricky against Westchester. He showed off his whole repertoire, spinning, reversing, and scoring 32 points along the way. And the number one play actually goes back to the 5th of March. TJ Kenzora of El Toro opened up the season with a no-hitter. The San Diego State signee fan 12 in a 2 to nothing shutout victory over JW North. Well, that's it for this week. I'm Jonathan Gamis, and thanks for watching.